everybody, hope you're doing marvellously well. This is a rather fun one because we have the rather lovely Katie Ferrara coming in in a few minutes to record and we get to use the Evo 4. This is Evo by Audient. It is their brand new product. We've talked about it at the NAMM show. We went and we saw Andy there and Harry talk about it. We've already done one giveaway and a second one came out on Friday so you can enter to win this lovely product. What we love about it is it has a smart game function, so we're going to get to use that. That is going to make it so for all of us it's idiot-proof to record and allows you to move quickly. And if you're a beginner, it means you're going to get great usable results without having those issues of digital clipping. It's a great device. We talked about it the other day. It has the JFET input guitar DI, which is really wonderful. It's becoming an industry standard now on any decent interface. So for it to be in a product that is this inexpensive is rather wonderful. Of course, there's two mic line inputs on the back. There's a left and right going out to, you know, your powered monitors, if you so have them. But we're going to work entirely on headphones here. So it's really, really lovely. It's sleek. It's fingerprintless, if that makes sense. So you, even my greasy hands aren't going to show up on here. So it's going to be very exciting. Katie is somebody we've worked with a couple of times before, so you'll recognize her and her music. What we love about her is she's a, an amazing singer-songwriter who performs live every day. In fact, immediately after the hour or so she's going to spend with us, she's actually going to do a live session. So she's the perfect artist for us to show off what it is to be like to be a singer-songwriter and record on this. So it's going to be really rather wonderful, so stay tuned for that. And don't forget, you can win one of these. In fact, because there's two competitions, you can win it one of six times. And we're going to use a dynamic microphone, the Lewitt dynamic microphone, and a Lewitt condenser. So it's a pretty inexpensive setup, to say the least, and I'm just going to be monitoring on a pair of Audio-Technica headphones. So lots of fun. Stay tuned for some uh, fun recording. So let's position some microphones. OK, so I'm going to go 12 to 14th fret here with the large diaphragm. Um, uh, 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 it's always going to be a balance, but let's get that done first, and then we'll put the vocal mic in afterwards. So we're going to condense it on the acoustic, try to keep it away from the sound hole, dip it down around about there. We can always twist the mic a little bit away from the sound hole. I also sort of want to get back a bit because I don't want to be so close that if Katie moves like any rational person would while they're performing, if I'm so close, the, the tone is going to change massively and also she might knock the mic. So let's pull back a little bit. So there's enough room for the, sorry to move you, but like swing around and actually enjoy playing music. The whole point of our job is to allow great performances. And if the microphone placement is so restrictive that the artist can't actually move and enjoy it, they're going to be like, I can't move. And that's how it will sound. The great thing about using um, dynamic microphones for vocals, it's just, just it's completely freeing. It will make life a lot easier. You can put an, a U47 up there and like, oh, it's so great. And then all you have is guitar bleed in it. So you're much better off doing this. And again, I'm going to find a place where this is just like not in the way and not something that you have to think about every five seconds. Actually, I'm not even going to use this. This is kind of hindering. It's kind of pointless. Do you enjoy watching me flailing around? <laughs> so the question is, is that is that comfortable-ish? Yeah, I think. A little higher. A little bit higher. A little higher. Yeah. Is that good? Yeah, that's good. So moving over to the Evo. So what we're going to do is we're going to have we're going to use completely use the smart gain function. So I'm going. You can apparently select both microphones at the same time and have them both be read. But let's just do one at a time. So I select smart gain. I select the microphone I want to do, which is going to be the dynamic microphone for the vocal. And then to enable it, I'm going to hit this. And would you sing the loudest part, please? If I left this city line Through the blazing telephone wires Felt to guide me with reflected light How far do I run the Great. Fantastic. Now we'll do the same thing with the acoustic guitar. So I'll select two, but make sure I turn the phantom on because, of course, it requires phantom power. Now, smart game mode, select the mic we're going to do, which, of course, is the second one. And Katie, would you play the loudest part, please?
Thank you very much. Let's do it from El Topo. I can hear the howl that goes through my mind Pulling me closer in the dead of night My heart's pounding like never before Into the forest is where I belong If I left this city line Packed my bags and drove for miles and miles Would you guide me with reflected light? I far do I run? I hear the wolves cry. 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 I look to the moons in that reddish hue, illuminate the past colored shades of blue. I dig beneath the branches and watch them unwind Memories of the child I left behind If I left this city line Through the blazing telephone wires Felt you guide me with reflected light I thought you were up and I hear the wolves cry I hear the wolves cry Torching light in the velvet sky No more painted faces Worn out places The birds are flying high If I left this city line Through the blazing telephone eyes Felt you guide me with reflected light I thought you were up and I hear the wolves cry I hear the wolves cry So I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you ever so much, Katie, for coming by. Audion, as you know, have been something we've championed for a long time for affordability. Now with their, this sub-brand, this Evo brand here, they've taken it to a new level because they've made something which is even more inexpensive. But with the smart gain function, I think it's gonna open up so many people to be able to make music. So thank you ever so much, Audion, and uh, enjoy the Evo. You're gonna be able to download these multitracks. You're gonna hear the recordings for yourself. So there's a link, not only to enter to win, but also to download these multitracks and mix and have fun, do some additional production, et cetera, to uh, Casey's tracks. Have a marvelous time recording and mixing. <laughs>